Both of my boys have severe hemophilia. I remember the first time that Elias got his medication. Holding him down and strapping him down onto the bed, he was just screaming and screaming, and I felt like I was torturing my son. Those moments were some of the hardest moments. At that point, I decided, okay, you know, this is either gonna make me or break me, and I'm not gonna let this break me. Hemophilia is a genetic disorder. It's basically the inability to properly create a blood clot. Blood coagulation is actually this exquisite process. You might think of this as a set of dominoes, but in hemophilia, one of those dominoes is missing, so the dominoes don't continue to fall. And what that means is they just don't stop bleeding. The first time that we found out we had hemophilia in our family was at the birth of my brother. It was a scary time for hemophiliacs. It truly was a death sentence in many ways. The medication wasn't anything like it is now. Pfizer Rare Disease has been involved in the development of treatments for hemophilia for over 20 years. Therapies have changed the quality of life for patients, but until there's a cure, we will work tirelessly to develop treatments that can change lives. I really want my children to be able to experience everything and not to be sitting on the sideline. The future is really exciting because science is just moving right ahead. Gene therapy is an exciting area of research for the treatment of hemophilia. Pfizer's goal is to develop a targeted, possibly one-time treatment that fixes the root cause of the disease. It's revolutionary because we'd replace the defective gene with healthy DNA to create a normal, continuous production of the blood clotting protein that people with hemophilia are missing. When it comes time to cut the ties and to let them go on their own, maybe the medicine is so fantastic that they can just lead normal lives.